Hey, what's up, guys? Listen, I'm just playing around. This is a quick video. I don't know if you guys remember the uh, crank power supply that'll output up. Whoa! Hey, hit the wrong button there. That'll put up, put out up to like 12 volts. So I'm just playing with it here today. When I did the original video on it, I was criticizing, quite rightly, because I didn't put a load on it when I tested it and the output was all over the place. So now, here we are. I've got a little 12 volt load on her. And I'm cranking it at as steady a rate as I can and what we'll do what we'll do is take a look at it on the oscilloscope okay so there's your oscilloscope view and you'll be able to see here on the peak to peak voltage if you watch that carefully as I crank it at a reasonable rate we're getting at a max of about 220 millivolts peak to peak so it is not terribly terribly efficient someone else mentioned could we just put a big uh, capacitor across it to kind of smooth things out well there you go there is a 10 microfarad capacitor across the bulb all this stuff here, nothing's connected. It's just right here. That's all we're all we're dealing with. So there's our big capacitor across the bulb. And while it does seem to make some difference, let's take a look at the scope. You can see we're still getting peaks of about. 180 to 200 millivolts so not a whole lot of difference let me see if I can find a bigger meteor capacitor to plop in there how about 3300 microfarad that's about as big a dog as I got in my kennel let's see if we can see if we can get her in there oh yeah Oh yeah, she's in there. Then we begin the cranking. You can see the bulb's looking pretty well lit. Let's go up to the scope. Make sure we're focused pretty good. And I think you will see a bit of a difference. We're looking at a steady 60 millivolt peak to peak ripple so that does work now let's get dangerous what if we switched from Armstrong power to lipo power I know it's kind of hard to see here what I'm going to do There we go, mount the old drill chuck on there and try not to break my arm. Ready? That's like a medium speed. Here you can take a look at it. Try not to. There we go. That's swinging around there pretty good. <laughs> Let's put it on the scope. And no, I have not been smoking any wacky tobacco. There's our medium speed. Looking at about 80 millivolts. And if I crank her up. And honestly, that's as fast <laughs> as I'm going because I really 
do not need a broken ulna or radius today. Anyway, I know it's a short video, just kind of messing around here in the shop waiting for another video to finish, so I thought I would share something fun with you guys. If you enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe and don't try this at home. That's it. I'm out. Peace.